All right, welcome back everybody to episode 74 of the Expert Expert Iron Man playthrough of War Tales. Uh, we have a tomb to get into today. And that should be the end of Ludern once we do that. Uh, I need to buy food. You're not from Edoran, right? What do I want to buy? I guess I could actually buy like Start selling them our products now. Lady I'm trying to talk here, okay? I could buy like candy cherries or something. Um, I also can buy. It tastes like swamp water. What is it? I think it's wolf meat and beer. But I don't think they sell beer. I can make candied fruit. Oh, it takes a bunch of fruit. Never mind. Can't do that. Uh, apple pancakes and missing apples, eels and cabbage, muttons and grape, chicken and cabbage, cheese and venison. Oh, I can make trappers fondue. They sell both of that here. Yeah, beer and wolf meat. Uh, they might sell beer here, actually. Croc swine. Oh, perch and cabbage. I can make some cabbage perch. All right, let's buy the cabbage. You're not from Edoran, right? Let's you buy the cheese. Years. How much salt do I have? 32. All right, let's buy that. I'm going to buy the grain as well. And we'll buy the venison. And then I'm going to go check the inn to see if they sell beer. My grandfather was a soldier. Sell cider. Why do they sell cider, but also beer and huge roll ribs? What the hell? Do I have a recipe that uses that? Oh, Actually, let's talk. Is anyone here any decent? Bloodthirsty brute. I don't need a brute though. I need a swordsman. Strong warrior. And then a brute with nothing. All right, so we can make some trappers fondue now. And we can make some cabbage perch. And I guess I mean I I could always just make bread if food ever becomes a a, a dire situation. I could just make a bunch of bread, so I guess we're pretty okay. Mm, yeah, I think that's fine then. Oh, this is done. You don't need to be doing this anymore. You can go hang out in the tent. And very nice. I don't sell so yeah, that's actually I'm gonna buy his salt too. I don't sell crocs. Don't you sell something? So Grease. Mm, I don't need any of that. You're not from. I don't need your cherries either. Um, maybe I can buy the cherries. I don't know if you can buy them in other regions or not. Workshop. Kind of awful. It wants me to get like, yeah, upgraded stocks or impaling steak. All right, we'll upgrade the impaling steak. Sure. Why not? Whatever. All right, well. Uh, I think that's all for here. You won't find any plague remedies in this shop. Alazar refuses to give us any. Try the smugglers. Alazar refuses to give us any. Oh, those are kind of dicks, aren't they? Uh, do I want this bow? Level 11. Holy. Is Menace me 10 yet? No, he's 9. Um. I mean, Mudsling is pretty good. I think if I think because I think he is gonna get the um the double bow perk because anticipation's crap and lone wolf's also not super great five meters and it's a ten percent damage done like mm. it might be a multiplicative ten percent which is actually very good but but I I think he realistically gets second weapon and then if he has the the mud sling bow he could do some pretty strong stuff with that. Although, actually, there is one thing I need to do while I'm here. 
and it's put this st stupid splat thing away. Uh, I guess I can put this sword away too. I don't need it. Wrath, Taunt, and First Aid. Who am I giving those to? They don't sell beer here. Um, was there something else I wanted to do? I don't think so. I think we're good to just go to the uh, thing now. Head on down to the small trackers camp. I need to go here as well. The fate. Okay. Yeah. All right. So I just need to go over there. On to Ed. Hello. We are uh, moving. I must currently have a run speed buff or something. I feel like I'm running really fast. I actually need to pick up all my flowers now. Oh, I'm at 910. Wait, hold up. It's because I have like 8,000 trade goods on me. Well, maybe these guys have something. I need a camp anyway. Okay, there is a tavern here. Living in the swamp isn't always easy. Hey, this person has beer. The elders say what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Uh, do I want the wine and cider? I don't think so. All right, who do we have here? Can Kenimbenos, clever and quick, not bad combo, and Mava, nimble and unlucky. Oof, unlucky. All right, well, I can make three beer infused wolf ribs now. Oh, it only takes one beer. Oh, that's nice. Isn't that convenient? We have a ton of weight in ghost carcasses currently. That's one of the things that's holding us down, weighing us down pretty bad. Uh, I think I just take the stamps from these helmets. Those helmets are very nice. Actual good helmet perk. Needs to go on it. A medium helmet. I don't think I actually have much of a purpose for them anymore, though. Halt doesn't need it. Wouldn't doesn't make sense. Uh, I think, and I think both, uh, oh, I could just give Parmigal a new helmet because his helmet is trash, but Gerard already has it imprinted. Oh, uh, Gerard, your helmet's looking a little old there, bud. Holy crap. It's a level six helmet. Well, you know, it is what it is. Uh, we should probably camp as well. Do one of these. Oh, we have a lot of delicious mer uh, food. Do a little bit of that. Eat these mushrooms. Burn one wood. Uh, do I have any like meat or anything? I don't. Wow. Oh, I have eleven fish right here. Okay, well, yeah, the food situation's not very good. 48 of my food, quote unquote, is brandy. Okay, you don't need to be on watch when we're camping in town. All right. Pony and Dark Steed as relationship has improved. Nice, dude. Good old pony and dark steed becoming better friends. Knowledge of the world is increased. Cult and Marlore, 400 XP again. Oh, what's up, Kornick? Reach battle, a new injury. I'm not built for this life. I should have listened to my mother and become a farmer. What? He's not even hurt. Leave the group in awkward silence. No. 
Um, sure. We'll just do medicine. He's not even hurt. He's being a baby, but I have lots of medicine, so it doesn't really matter. All right. Well, um, I have a bunch of iron. I feel like I probably do. Ah, oh, 187. We might have to burn some of my materials here. How much rhyme steel do I have as well? 30. Mmm. Might actually uh, have to do a little crafting here. Not what I was expecting to do this episode, but it still looks like this is needed. I think I need to just make a bunch of ghost stuff and then sell it. Because I have 122 ghost hides too. So what's the best ghost item I should make? Ghost buckler. It's probably just going to be a weapon of some sort because I need to burn iron mostly. Um, ghost pike. Ghost bill hook. I need to burn iron and white leather. That uses a shitload of wood. Uh, no, probably like a ghost axe or sword or something. Okay, the gladius maybe? Uses a lot of coal. The great, let's make a couple great gladiuses. I can make eight of these before I run out of coal. First crafting bonus. Oh, luckily, it's right at the top, too. I also can just make... Oh, I don't think I can actually make ghost throwing knives. I might be able to make... Um, some of the patches or whatever. Layers. Armor layers. Though a lot of them require, like, grease and stuff. Grease is a valuable commodity because it's required in, like, so many things. Alrighty. Um, I mean, I could buy coal. I'll probably make, like, two more of these. And then I'm going to need to go to my camp and turn on the buff that gets me more money when I sell stuff that I crafted, and then I'm going to sell them all. Maybe I'll just make... Actually, we're just going to make all of them until I run out of coal. And then I'll just buy more coal. I do... I, I do actually need to make rhyme steel gear, too, though. I have so many people who need items. It's rough, man. It's rough out here. I wonder how hard the Arcadian Steel is going to be to craft. How fast it's going to flash and stuff. Alright, we made eight. These sell for 168 right now. We can go in here. We can go to our little flag. And we can do... Uh, trade fair. I think I'm going to do overflowing motivation. As well. All right. And then what else can I make here? Surely I can just make some patches, layers. Reinforced layers, ones that don't take uh, grease, ideally. The only one I could really do is stag, but this also takes rope. These take materials, too. Sells for 66, though. Kind of spicy. 
Even these layers sell for 46. Iron leather, leather cloth. We're gonna make eight stags. Hello, kind sir. Oh, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> the card Oops. Almost key to have 252 to each after all. popping trade fair. Hey, uh, that's, that's kind of a lot of gold. And then my stags. Another 500 gold on top. All right. And I have 100 raw materials. Look, and I dropped my weight by doing all that by like 100. So weight is now much better. I wonder if trade fair accounts for food that you make too. It probably does. All right. Well, thank you, ma'am, for your money. And I will uh, take my leave now, I guess. And we'll actually go do the thing that I said. Maybe. Hold on. I want, now I got to look at rhyme steel stuff. You already have a battle plate. I have three rhyme steel battle plates right now. Do I actually want a fourth? <sighs> I, uh, I don't know, man. Gerard needs a new sword. Oh, but he's not level 10 yet. Lorwell has a rhyme steel ballsy blade. Kornick doesn't need anything. I guess he no. He already has the rhyme steel armor armet too. How about I want to look at making some medium helmets. Halt could use one. Marlor could use one because he's using a a cloth helmet right now, a light helmet. All right, what is the medium helmet, and what does it take? The rhyme steel, rhyme steel Morion. You need not affected by fragility or vulnerability. That's not very good. Not affected by a bunch of debuffs. It only gives guard and armor. Not affected by slowdown or blackout. I think, <laughs> I think actually this celerity. Thing on this hat is actually the best effect that you have. The ability is actually not bad either. It's either the hat or the iron iron bar bar barbute. I think are your best too. But I think it's the hat because who cares if you take less damage? Just don't get hit forehead. Um, again, I mean, you, so you could just make this for the stats, the garden armor, and then, oh wait, ramp steel's eight. Oh, I'm stupid. It's Arcadian steel that I've been looking at soon that people can start wearing. Why did I think it was 10? Start with my brain. Dude, this Arcadian Steel Battle Plate is going to be insane. Steel Spalders. Steel Waistcoat. I might have to start with some Steel Waistcoats just to make sure everyone's like healthy. Yeah, so these like ghost throwing weapons. Hey, they don't sell for very well. They sell for 12 each and you make four. So it's 48 gold. Actually, not that bad. I just don't have enough wooden coal to be making like a ton of these. It's fine. I need that iron anyway, so it's it's not a big deal. Oh, these are level nine. The, the colossal layers. 
And it's either rat or falcon right now. Rat is so strong. 8% crit. Does anyone need these? I think Parmigal already has them. Yep. I could give them the Gerard as well. He has reinforced. He doesn't have Colossal yet. I think these guys are actually going to keep Stag on my tanks. At least my Maceman. Because they don't need the, the crit or anything. Well, I could actually switch this up to give them the movement speed. Layers. But they don't need that either. That's overkill. Alright. Enough. Wasting time. Let's go do this. Go do these ruins. Let me up. Hello. Where's the... There it is. Right, let's go talk to these guys. I freed their people. Hello. You brought them back safe and sound. They told us how you defeated those bandits. We still can't believe how brave. Oh well, you know, hey, it's nothing. You know, we're just a couple of brave men and women here making some money. Speaking of money, where's my money? Praise be Saint Jeru for guiding you to us. I don't know how to thank you. Maybe you will find this useful. Eighty gold. Uh, can I have your stuff now? Don't you have like a box or something somewhere? I know the, the chest, but I already stole. Oh, your wood. Can I have this? What the? F I saved your people. Give me your wood. All right, what's up, guys? You came to visit us? Yeah, sure. Why not? Welcome. I can't thank you enough for what you've done. Okay. I try not to dwell on what could have happened to me. Every time my mind wanders to that cage, I start working. I pray, or I think about your troop to lift my spirits. Oh man, these guys, come on, shucks. I'm listening to the retelling of your adventures for the fourth time. This tale never gets old. Dude, what is with all the like, oh, cut wood. I need wood. These guys are really, uh, buttering me up. I wonder what those items I got were. I have to check them out. If they just are, are for selling or they're for something else. Uh, let's look. Oh, nope. They're both knowledge plus one. I do not need knowledge. I'm also going to get a shitload of knowledge when I go into this tomb as well. Because tombs are always a ton of knowledge. Oh, more wood. I need wood. Ah, bears. Oh. Here's the, uh, the thing. Oh, more cutting wood. Good, I need wood. <laughs> they added a pitten so you can go up to the tomb. You can't do the tomb in this region until you finish the story. Another 13, nice. It's going to be all coal. You have something to trade. Strangers usually don't. <sighs> no, your stuff's not worth anything. I have no other hunts for you. We're so glad to have Sununa back. Oh. They got really nothing to say to me? And steal their trap? No, I'm not stealing their stupid trap. Nope, nope. Get up there! Oh my god, they almost caught me. Stupid bears. <laughs> All right, the tomb. Let's go. Mm, okay, the trackers. Take this. It's dark inside. We cannot come with you. We must patrol the grounds. The beast could return. Oh, they gave me some torches. Thank you. Don't worry about us. Be careful. Thanks. Entering the tombs is taboo for our people. The gods built them and still dwell there as spirits. Okay. I've never had the honor of going inside. You must be the first strangers who are allowed to set foot in there. What an unsettling day. 
Oh, she's gonna come with me? Thought. Why is your armor broken? From the fight? Oh, you telling me I'm getting punished because I didn't repair her armor? Or because I let her take hits in the previous fight? Dude, scammed. Uh, okay. And then I wanted to do something. I wanted to make those better torches. The looters torches. These take grease though, which is kind of yucky. But they're way better. Eight vision, five crit. We're going to actually give these to people. So like Laura will. Here's your torch. Um, Mar, here's your torch. I think I'll give, I'll give them to Gerard and Parmagal too. Um, I could give one to Rohan, perhaps. Or Heronor. I don't know if that's a good idea, though. I guess Forest Fight. All right, let's go in. Inward. Goodbye. Oh, she's here again. Hello, again. I can't. I never thought I would have this honor. Yeah. We're about to explore the tomb of a man and a woman revered as guardian gods in Ludern and are among the foremost deities of Harag. Okay. Cool. Let's go do it then. I've never done this tomb. Uh, so this is all new to me. A lot of chests here. An inscription reads... Horun, maybe the name of the woman. Yeah, okay, that would make sense. We have the Narcis. Oh. Chests are just... You just take them. Okay. Thank you. Uh, we'll go to the spiderwebs. Odd moth-eaten drapes and a myriad of spiderwebs blocked away. Set it on fire. Okay, we got a little skelly tan. Got a bunch of bones. Color of loyalty. Every time this unit kills an enemy, you gain one valor. Ah, oh, a nice little animal accessory that gets you valor. Uh, ancient is damaged. You can use a lectern to restore it. Oh, that was a combat's lectern thing. Uh, these warriors are buried at the same time as the main occupants of the tomb. Hard to say whether it was an honor or a sacrifice. Okay. Any symbols? I don't see any symbols. Uh, let's go put this leg thing on the lectern. Wait. Combatants. Restoration. Oh. Builder. Oh, okay. It's just like one. Okay. It's one of these things. Not actually uh, a thing. One of three. One of three. And this is also going to be one of three. Okay, let's try first of everything. Two of three. Oh, interesting. Uh, let's try this. One of three. So one of these two is correct, and this one is correct. Try this, this, and this. Two of three. So it could be this. Oh, it is. Better decipher it after learning the corresponding runes. Cool. Okay, well, I restored it, but that doesn't really help me. Very exciting. It's so dark in camp. All right, onward. Surely you're not going to run into the ghoulies. In the hall is strange. Your companions sense eyes watching them. The pot shatters on the floor, giving away, uh, giving away the creatures that were following them. 
Oh, enemy reinforcements. Moles and creepers. Level 12. Hey, these mobs are going to hit very hard at level 12. Look how much brighter the room is. Uh, looks like we can all fit over in this area. Well, kind of. Let's put a real thick boy right there. Visitor. Cornick. Rohan's not the thickest. Oh, it's only really Inquisitor, Sibbert, and Kornick are my really tanky people. So, it's so much brighter with these new torches. There'll probably be enemies over there. And there's probably be enemies in the middle here. Oh, this is a small battlefield. Oh, there's definitely going to be enemies above us. And there, I think there's definitely going to be enemies over here. Alright. Let's, uh... Oh yeah, you can throw this and it applies a burning on the ground. I wonder if that burning area gives vision too. Where's Parmigal? Mm. Not a large enough area. Perhaps I can move him to like... How come it's not hitting Laura will? It should be, right? Now it's not hitting Cult and Inquisitor because they're in the darkness. Kornick is not in the darkness. Okay, it is hitting Kornick. All right. Hello, Mole Rat. Hello, Creeper. Oh, she's an ally still. I don't have control over her. Okay. Ooh, almost got him. A little, nothing that a little Wrath can't fix. Um, and that's fine. All right. Damn. That was a lot of damage. Oh, there's some more room down here. They could be. I see. Interesting. There's a wall blocking, so I can't actually see that area. Hmm. Let's just rat this. I don't know which rat's going next. Yeah, there's nothing else down there. That's good to know. Something way far left just went. Hundred and twenty five strength. Not even Cornic has that much strength. Um, there's probably enemies over here and she moved. I'm worried about Lorewell just getting ambushed. I think I just need to move her soon. Well, okay. He just one shot that thing. Ooh, found cult. That's not ideal. Oh. Oh, wow. Only did 87. Okay. Well, that's not that bad then. I was worried about it being much higher. We're going to taunt that off her. Do not attack her, sir. I'm surprised that creeper could make it. Honestly. 
Okay. Also surprised a rat attacked, managed to hit call. It's, there's a group over here. They just managed to make that work. Oof, our pathing is bad. Prisoner might just taunt this mole rat off of him. All right. That's fine. Well, Rohan's actually not that tanky, so that's not great. But I'm sh yeah, he'll be fine. It's fine. Whatever. Not a big deal. I don't I don't know how spear wall works. I think he won't be able to see the mob until it's right next to him, so it won't it won't work correctly. I need to engage this creeper, but I don't want to move Sibbard either. I want him to stay here. For any potential mobs on the left. I mean, I think Gerard needs to come up here. I don't want him to move that far though. We're walking on the left. You hear it. You hear the move, but nothing changes. Okay, this guy goes next, so I, I need to pull Sibbard now. Um, we'll just do the normal. One, two. Ooh. Oh my, 10 damage. I will never financially recover. She try like how she just drops her torch on the ground. Uh, I guess this is fine. Dagger throw. Dead. And I kind of need to drag her back over here. I need light over here. Hello. Oh yeah, the counterattack mace. Her shield. So strong. Oh, hello there. Hey, Kornick just got protection. That means there's a lot of mobs over there. <laughs> that is what that means. Goodbye. Oh, he didn't move, which means there's a wall or a mob behind him. I see you. Yeah, my little torches provide a lot more light. So barrage actually kind of works. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Get him, Iron Ore. That was to the left again. I think Kornick just got brutality. Um, I don't think I actually want Marlo to do much. Cult is also not going to do much this round, I think. More feet on the left. You keep hearing movement over here. Uh, I mean, I guess Cult can walk up and swing here. Not really going to do anything because it's only one mob, so... Rox is strength oil, I guess. That's good. That was rather painful. Oh, is it going to show me where all the reinforcements are? Oh, thank you, video game. Isn't that nice of you? There's only three reinforcements. Interesting. This creeper is probably over here, if I were to guess. Ta-da! I found him. 
I just wrath you, do you die? Yes. Holy shit. A 293 wrath? Okay. Yep. Gall is just killing everything. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. Yeah. He's actually just killing everything. All right. All right. So some rats are going next. This one. Oh, look. All the mobs disappeared. Oh, that rat wasn't supposed to die. Hmm, this is awkward. Uh-oh. I didn't expect that to kill him, but it did. And now he's dead. Everyone fall back a bit. Inquisitor's the front line. Oh. Oh, he didn't die. Didn't get a crit, so it's not dead. <sighs> I need to pull Gerard. I like. I don't want to do this as a turn because this feels awful. But I just don't want him to get hit anymore. It feels so bad to make that a turn. I don't think there's any more mobs over here. I think it's just these two. The rest spawned much higher, so they'll attack these guys up here. So we can just walk this way. She's just gonna run at anything she can see. Um, I could have Marlor set up a. Spear wall. I think there were mobs over here. So I think I actually move down one and then we'll do this. That's fine. I'm just gonna leave that alone. Farmer girl already went. Mara hasn't gone yet. But I'm gonna put Sibbard in front of Men as Me just in case. Just in case. Yep. Just in case that happens right there where he does not crit. Do not want men as me to take that hit. Completely unnecessary for him to take that hit. Uh, I think we could just pull these guys left. You don't need to be down there anymore, and I'm pretty much just blo wasting turns right now. Wait, how did he get next to me? What the hell? How did he do that? How did he not walk through the torch? Uh oh. Oh, good. It's attacking. Ouch. That was a lot of damage. I actually don't know how that rat got to Marlor without him spear walling it. Um, I guess Inquisitor can just swing. Mm. Oh, another shot that didn't, didn't do what it needed to do. No crits, men is me. What's happening, buddy? I think there's one more mob back here. Uh, we do not need to set up another barrage. Cornet can go look around. Hello? There's someone over here? We got protection. Isn't protection three units? Oh, two. Okay, I don't think, I don't think there's anyone over here then. All these mobs are not... In combat. Hello. 
Don't mind me. I'm just walking around. I think there's only three left. Hmm. Interesting. Um, I can't kill any of these. Oh, I didn't get a dagger through there anyway. Oof. Well, you'll just hang out. That's fine. A new round is starting. Oh, yeah. They get turns real soon. They're definitely going to survive. <laughs> no. He's dead. I don't need to... Goodbye. <laughs> I don't need to worry about that. Fight's over. That was, uh... That was a little spicy. Do I want the carcasses and the rats? Not really. We'll just do a repair all, even though that's very expensive. All right, what do we have here? Scholar companion might be able to decipher the instructions on this headstone. Read. Marlor is a journeyman. And Aurea is experience. We'll have Marlor do it. He's a higher tier. The inscription reads, Beware whom you challenge, intruder. Know that Narcis never lets an offering or offense go un unpunished. Okay. Narcis never lets an offense go un unpunished. Okay, what is an offense? No symbols in this rune either. Let's go left again. What the heck is that thing? Golden key. I don't have a golden key. There's something in the folds of this banner. What? How is there a ruby in the banner? There's a weird statue thing. I'm guessing water comes out of it? No, oh, there's still no symbols anywhere. There's some skeletons up there. All right, explore further. Well, here's the puzzle that I have zero clues for currently. Combat's codex again. Door is locked. True. All right, well, I guess we'll just keep walking around. Oh, it's a rat. That I can talk to, apparently. It's plagued. Oh, another thing. Fetish of the Ancients. Bruce reduces by one the amount of terror applied to this companion at the end of their turn. Oh. That's... Kind of bad. But that's fine. Hello, rat. This plague rat has strayed uh, far from its nest. Looks frightened and vulnerable. Let it go. I don't. The three paths open up before you. A banner hangs in front of each one. Which way will you go? Moon, stars, or sun? Uh. I don't know. Wait. If I go back here. There's star banners. Right? Is it star? Maybe we do this one? So the middle one? What are the options? Moon, stars, and sun. This is stars and this is sun? I think because that's like the same order here I, th I, th I think it's stars we're gonna we're not gonna do it yet because there might actually be like a thing that tells me instead of just guessing a random banner oh color companion yep read that or on you who walked uh the path of the stars first soon reunited together the rest is unreadable Path of the Stars. 
Okay, nothing there. Dude, this is a big tomb. What the hell? I still don't see any symbols anywhere. There's a tomb. Oh, here's a thing. Oh, there's a symbol. Destruction. We learned a new rune. Fighting a uh, lion. Wow. Wowie. Oh, there we go. We got a symbol. Red things. This is a dead end too. My first dead end. Dude, this lady is probably not going to be too happy about us breaking this tomb in our party. Oh, that was almost not good. The grave is empty. That's impossible. The goddess's body should be here. Uh-oh. Those damn scholars. They have the gall to move her. We must find them before they take her from Luden. Okay. I mean, there's a skeleton in there. No, no, no. Those damn scholars. All right, we'll find her. All right, so we got red symbols now. And this is a guy of stars, right? That's what it said. What the hell? Oron, you who walk the path of stars first, soon reunited together. What does that mean? You're being followed. Your companions hear a raspy br uh, breath echoing against the walls. Suddenly, your torches illuminate a distorted face. Hello, creepers. Hey, look, I can actually see a rat. I can actually see a couple of them because my torches are so bright. Interesting. Bunch of nice torches. All right, we're, we're going to go over here on the left. Uh, but I also think we're not going to do this combat right now. We will do it next episode and we'll finish um, exploring the tomb. Uh, so for now, that is it. We are Dunzos McDunzos. Is this everybody? Oh, no. I was like, this is not enough people. Actually, I think we're going to go down here. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, there's not enough spots. Hmm. Not enough spots. Too many of my torches are over here. I need to have somebody see that rat. I guess it's not important that I see it. One of my rogues should be over there. Do I actually need someone over here? Yeah, probably. This fight's gonna be kind of yuck. Oh, this... Yeah, this arena is... Yikes. Oh, there's no reinforcements this time, though. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we can't fit there. Why would you put somebody down here? That's such a bad idea. All right. Anyway, uh, like I said, like a minute ago before, before, before I started doing all that stuff. Uh, yeah, this episode's over. We'll do this fight next time as well as finish exploring the tomb. Uh, no doubt. Although this tomb seems really big. It has a lot of rooms and stuff, but I'm still not worried. We'll get it done. Anyway, uh, thanks everybody for watching and I will catch you in the next episode. See you later.